G'day, Peter here from Comfort Zone Insulation. Uh, uh, I hope you enjoy our next video about insulation. And just remember, if you need a quote, click on the link and uh, we're happy to help you out. With all the damage I've found on this roof, I think this is probably a roof that was uh, done during the insulation grant and insulated and the labourers at the time they smash open a bunch of tiles all the way around the roof so then they can let the heat out and let a bit of cool in and get the bats in um, but they break heaps of tiles so, so you can see this one here is a bit funny because it's actually hanging down from the other tiles so it's not even not even put back in properly um, and I've probably found 20 tiles on the roof that that are not put back in properly like this. Um, so I'm not sure quite what's wrong with this one. Oh yeah, they've broken the broken the tops off it, so it doesn't actually doesn't actually um, uh, stay in there the way it's supposed to. It's actually a broken tile, and it'll over time it'll just keep sliding down again. But anyway, um, I've slid it back up a bit. That'll do for now. I'll just come back over here to where there's so now when you're kicking the tile, if you stand on the roof and do it with the back of your heel like that, you won't break your toes. And you can if you get stuck you just slide down again. You can see that's just chipped a little bit off the front of the tile there. It's not a big deal, but um, um, but that's where you have tradesmen on your roof going over your tiles. You can see that tile. That's normally I'd just lift up the top of it and slide it out. Like that. <laughs> that tile was broken right through, and you can see the water damage on the inside of the crack there. So it's obviously leaking. So anyway, so this one's got a clip under the front end of it. That's the this old tile in and and yeah that's the telltale signs of people installing bats but I think in the job. This is a, this is the tile removed from installing the vent. So I'll just put that one in over here. Just the one. And so we just slide it into into place like that. And then slide it up and just lift it up onto the onto there. Just give it a kick at the same time while you're lifting it onto this batten. You just give it a little kick with your foot. And then, then and now slide it on down on top. There we go. Job done. Yeah, so that's as easy as it is to um, replace a tile. So I don't know why tradesmen, when they break tiles, don't just replace them for customers and be done with it instead of putting silicon on the job but anyway so these are the tile clips that came off and uh, and as you can see it's a bit bit bent so I'll just bend it back into shape a little bit but um, uh, that should have gone back on the tile last time when the guy put it in there so Kick it in the place, okay. put the tile clip in there and then it just hooks under on the bottom of the timber underneath. There we go, see? So that just holds that tile down, which holds this down. And when you kick them up, uh, oftentimes they'll just pop off. Right? And there's two types of tile clips like this. There's a wire one like this or there's a flat um, sheet metal type one. Um, anyway, so... And just put the top down. There we go. Done. So, um, makes you wonder why tradesmen don't uh, just spend two minutes to replace a tile for.